Oh, here it comes. Like I said, imposter. Welcome back to Offered Outlaws, y'all. And in this video, y'all might remember the car that we're starting off with from the limo top speed video that I did on the massive booster track. Now, the video that I did on the massive booster track required a very specific gearing setup. And we're going to be getting rid of that in this video because this is going to be turned into, at least for the moment, a online multiplayer uh troll racing build and when i say troll racing essentially i mean going into random lobbies and being like hey you want to race this thing and then essentially just seeing how many people we can outrun now what we are going to do is we're going to leave the Solid Axle Pro setup that's underneath this thing right now because it's going to play into the build idea that I have in my head. However, we do need to switch out the tire setup. It's on flotation tires right now. We're going to need these because these will scoop the mud and it will allow it to absolutely devour pretty much whatever mud we put in front of it. Now, my only question, though, is are we going to need any additional suspension height? And we probably will. So what we'll do here is, and before we mess with that, I'm going to actually go ahead and put a mud racing tune uh, on this thing because, well, the let's just say the tune that's on it right now is not going to get it anywhere, and it's certainly not going to get it anywhere very quickly, uh, especially if we're talking about in the mud. So let's see what we're working with in terms of wheel and tire size. Now, let's see. Radius is 0.8. So that's actually pretty good. Um, as long as it's under like 1.0, you're fairly okay. Now, I am going to bump up the travel a lot. Oh, the springs are all distorted. Look at that. Oh, that is so like wacky looking. Um, we're going to bump the travel all the way up in the back as well. It's extremely stiff right now, though, because it had to be in order to sustain the speeds that we, well, told it to sustain. And that's not uh, its job anymore. So let's see. What's it going to be in the rear? Probably like, I don't know. 15, 5, and stiffness in the front is like 12. That's not too bad. Damping, I'll bump up to about 3,300. 3,300 in the front and 3,000 in the back. We'll kind of see how that does. Um, I don't think it's going to be brilliant, but I also don't think it's going to be terrible. Now, in terms of, let's see. I know it looks really goofy right now, and it's, I mean, well, here's the thing. I feel like there's no way this thing isn't going to look goofy, especially with what it is. But to turn it into the ultimate troll build, I'm actually going to remove the rear exit exhaust. And we're going to reroute that into a hood stack. Because, I mean, it's kind of, we're kind of at the level with this thing of like, why would you not? I mean, the only reason I'm going to is because of the sole fact that it would just be hilarious and ridiculous in every way. Oh my god. Hold on. So you could do side pipes. Actually, I kind of want to do... Wait a minute. What is... Oh! Oh, that's hilarious. Okay, so then that's the side pipe. And then that's going to be... So what is... Oh, I see. And then that starts the... Okay, what's the final one? That one's the Zumi exhaust. Okay, so what we'll do for this version of the build is these because they're just ridiculous and there's really no reason to not do them i mean oh my god we could put well no that clips with the exhausts so we're not gonna do that um what about so we're running cut fenders right now but it's not like we really need them we don't need the extra like cutouts and so i'll put those back and then, do we need the extra cage? No, because it clips through the exhausts. Okay, so that's fine. That's all sorted. Now, though, let me just go ahead and do... Oh, my God. Okay, we need to do a ridiculous design on the side. Now, I say ridiculous. I kind of want to put TC Customs, but also, like... I also want to put some kind of, like, you know taunt or something on the rear of it so let's see we'll do tc customs on the side and that in itself is gonna be i don't know i mean we'll make it just a tad bigger remember the sole point of this build 
is to absolutely just troll people like crazy. So we're going to duplicate that. We're going to bring the color back in just a little bit. We're going to make it like a 3D gray right there. And then we're going to copy both of those over to the other side. It does not have to be perfect by any means. It's probably going to be just a little bit off. But to be honest, I feel like that also adds to like the... I don't know, kind of the vibe of the thing. So now we're going to go to the back and we're going to put, hmm, yes, that's fine. We'll get the extra, uh, we'll get the extra layer. Go faster. That I like even more. You want to know something just delightful? Yours truly forgot this thing was manually shifted. So that's going to add an interesting dynamic to the racing here. So let's get up to the line and see if anyone is interested in running this thing. It's gonna be, it's gonna be quite interesting to see because I don't know what's running in this lot. Um, excuse me? What was that? Um, okay. Well, that was out of nowhere. Um, oh, he hello. Um, that's Bob, apparently. Uh, hi, Bob. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh no! It's a. Oh no. Oh, it's a cyber truck. Oh no. Of all the things to come in here and run into, a freaking cyber truck. Wait. I, it, oh, okay. All right. Well practice run. Oh no. I just realized a massive flaw with this thing. I just bottomed out the nose over the lip of that jump. I haven't used the nitrous, though, this entire run so far. This is a warm-up. Uh, did I just win that? Holy crap. Also, um, imposter. I see your username. Imposter. Yes, yes, you, imposter. All right, let's see. Actually, that's the new Vega, which I, as of recording this video, still have yet to get. Um... Oh, it's a tiny tire Vega. Of course it's a tiny tire Vega. Okay. Well, that first run actually played out somewhat better than I thought it would, considering the fact that I didn't use any nitrous. And I think we won, if not barely tied. So let's see if we can get them to actually, like, come over here and run. Eh, uh, race maybe? Yes. Oh, here it comes. Like I said, imposter. <laughs> One, go. Oh God, that's some lag. Oh, come on. Oh my God. This is actually going pretty well. I think we won on our nose, but we won. Where's the Vega? I thought the Vega was gonna... Oh, there it is. Um, I think this thing might have taken it. Oh, I forgot I had that horn. That horn is... I'm sorry. That horn is awful. This thing is also ridiculous with the nitrous. It's absolutely nuts with the nitrous. I'm... Oh! I didn't expect to fly that far. I didn't expect to fly anywhere near that far. I'm going to try a run now with no nitrous at all and see how it goes. Because I want to run this Vega again, but with no nitrous. Because I feel like, I don't know, I feel like the nitrous is, well, obviously it's going to have... A, oh, they just went. Okay. I wonder if they're running nitrous or not. They don't look like they are. or it, Well, maybe, never mind. Oh, I think they are running nitrous. They just spun it. Come on! Okay, well, so far... Oh, okay. <laughs> so far, no one in this lobby has been able to beat the, uh, the troll limo. And while I am impressed with the troll limo's performance, I'm kind of, like... I'm kind of actually, like, shocked that that Vega is not keeping up. Now, granted, the Vega might just be 
you know, getting spun out and, and bounced into walls constantly, and that might be why it's not keeping up. But I'm, again, still shocked that the Vega is not decimating us. Now, ooh, that thing is actually gnarly looking. I wonder what kind of a run this will do if I just started in third. All right, three, two, one, go. On the nitrous in third. Oh, okay. All right, well. Apparently, starting in third on the nitrous is the way to do it. Yeah, start in third on the nitrous and just leave it in third all the way through. Okay, that's just ridiculous. That's just... That's just actual insanity then. Okay, well, I didn't expect it to be that wild. Especially from just starting in third. I would actually bet that we can start in third and not use... Oh my god, I've never been that high off of that jump before. But, like, I would bet that we could start in third and not use the nitrous and still outrun most vehicles. But after those few races, that's definitely going to prove that this thing, um, it's quite the troll vehicle. So if y'all enjoyed this build and um, experimentation video, let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comments below. Let me know what you want me to do next, and I will see y'all in the next one. Talk to y'all later.